through what was going on. Just talk us through what was going on back at the Wayne's. There seemed to be a little bit of uh, argy bargy. There seemed to be a little bit of animosity. It looked like you were laying the smack of down today to prove a point. What exactly was going on there when you were going head to head in the weigh-in? Um, nothing, nothing going from mind. Us. You walk forward, I walk forward in each other's face. Um, I said to him, I'm going to knock you out. That's the hell about it. And you did exactly that. I mean, that's a, <laughs> a spectacular finish. Uh, I believe uh, it's the second fastest yeah. uh, in, in World War history. I mean, you know, uh, how does that make you feel? Um, it feels great. Um, I knew Seth, I knew the court Seth with the, with the shots. He'd been, he'd been in um, swimming the wars in his career. I knew his tune was going, so I knew if I landed, he, that would have happened. Mm -hmm. You said in the cage £50,000 would be a life-changing amount of money for you. Yeah. Have you got any idea what you'd spend on? <laughs> I don't know yet. Um, I'll go back, I'll, I'll think about it and I'll show you something good of it. Can you describe the eight second sequence to us and what happened in that and how did you? How were you able to get that shot? Um, well, well, when the fight got announced, I, I was watching Seth and he paused, when the fight he paused with his hands. I like reach out and if I step, if I, if I step to the right, I'll, I'll catch him with my, my left because I'm, I'm, I'm on half ball. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah. After the fight, or uh, after you knocked him out, you give him about a shot or two, and then you kind of realize you walked away before mm -hmm. the referee even had a chance to stop it. Do you feel it's important to sort of know when to hold back and yeah. when to when the sportsmanship should kick in? Um yeah, absolutely. Um, when I was hitting him, eyes was rolling all over the place, so I thought he's done anyway. So I just walked out the ref, jumped in, stopped it. You obviously you haven't got a scratch on you, you hardly broke a sweat in that fight. I mean, is this something that you want to get back in the cage as soon as possible now? Um, I, w I wanted to fight in July um, on a Glas for the Glasgow Glasgow card. Right. If not, or, or, the, or the Vegas card, wherever. So sometime in July, like, like fight in July. Um, I'll back in the gym Wednesday anyway to help my training partners. Gonna fight again in three weeks, so I'll back in the gym. Can you, in, in the pre-fight kind of uh, discussions we had this week, you talked a lot about how um, you know it's helped you to be over there in San Jose, you know, tr you know, training at AK and getting some time in there as well. Can you talk a bit about how that's kind of helped you improve as a fighter? Um, yeah, it did, did help a lot. Did help a lot. Um, just mixing it with top guys like Luke and stuff did help. And I went back to my gym um, in UTC and finished off in camp, so yeah, that's good. Is there anyone specific? Obviously you're saying you want to fight in July. Is there anyone you're looking to fight? Um, not really. I don't think I'm at the stage yet to call out people. Get to that. So I'll keep, as long as I keep climbing the ranks, I'll, I'll be happy. And how highly do you rank this win over your other previous victories? Um, well, I got, I got another 8 seconds knockout before. Um, when, I, when I was in my amateurs. So, I think this is one of the top ones though because it's such a big stage and yeah, I feel good. When you envision your very best left hand connecting, is that as good as it gets what you saw tonight? <laughs> yeah, that was perfection. Um, yeah, that was good. <laughs> uh, uh, Leon, uh, recently in uh, Europe, Makwan Americani had also a very fast knockout. Do you envision this as such a star making performance as, as it was for the Finnish fighter? Was this one? Uh, Makwan Amerikani also had an 8 seconds knockout. Do you f feel that your performance could make you uh, at such a big star as Makwan Amerikani became in, in the following months since that January performance? Um, well, hopefully, as long as I long as keep climbing, I don't, I don't, I don't really mind um, what happens. As long as I keep getting better and better. Like I said, I'm, I'm only 23 and I've got a long time left in the sport, so I'm going to be smart and yeah, let's keep going. Um, obviously, uh, if you get that fifty thousand dollar performance tonight bonus, um, mm -hmm. is that life changing for you? I mean, can you describe what that would mean for you financially? You know, back home in England. Yeah, absolutely. Um, that, that would change my life like altogether. But, um, I'll, I'll be able to commit to full time to MMA to, um, without worrying about money or anything. So, yeah, it would change my life. Forever. How are you currently supporting yourself financially and, and being a trained as a professional athlete? Okay. How are you at the moment uh, supporting yourself financially? Are you, are, do you have a, a full time yeah. job and how do you support yourself as a full time athlete? Yeah, well, I work at my gym as well, UTC, I teach classes. Um, I do my, my PTs and stuff like that, so yeah, it's good. You are of uh, Jamaican parentage. Um, yeah. You are actually born in Jamaica. How about a tough Jamaica? Just to mix things <laughs> up. Did you see that? That would be good. Um, <laughs> it would be good to, um, to have like more Jamaican fires coming out. I don't, I don't think it's big in Jamaica or in the Caribbean, anywhere like that, that, that side. So yeah, it would be good. The USC Jamaica, I'll headline it. <laughs> <laughs>
And you know, this was a, obviously a great performance, but it's also kind of sets the bar pretty high for your next one. Do you feel like, you know, obviously it's a very good thing for you, but do you feel maybe you gotta sort of do something even better or more spectacular next time? Um, not really. I, like I said, I'll go up to the gym again, get better. Um, if we get a five second, I get five seconds, and I count next time. If not, I'll fight all, all five, as long as I win the fight. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well